Hello YouTube and welcome to our video number 7 in this HTML and CSS tutorial for beginner series. Uh, in the last video we created a unordered and ordered list and we looked at the ways how you can make a nested list. So uh, let's delete this because this is we don't need any more our Christmas cocktail okay and we probably don't need H1 either okay in this video we're gonna make links and we're gonna make links to the other web pages web and we're gonna make actually the links to our own uh, uh, files that we make so that would be the links within the page that you created Okay, so let's let's take a look at that first. Okay, so first we would have to create. We'll write. Okay, paragraph. We want to create a paragraph, and in this paragraph we would say, "This is the best," uh, and let's say website. However, website, we would want to put in a link tags. And the way you write the link tag is you, you write uh, less than, then you write a, and then you write href, and then you put equal sign, and, and then you put double quotes. And remember I was talking how the, <clears throat> uh, the brackets actually they create, uh, they do some work for you. So let's say they see that this is a link, that you're creating a link, because whatever you're going to put inside these, uh, this uh, uh, double quotes is going to be a link. Okay, so what it does, it right away offers you whatever you can find in its own, uh, in, in, in the own uh, folder that we are working in. Okay, so let's say we click on that so now we're actually linking uh, already back to our own website okay so let's finish the syntax so now we have created a link okay but what we're gonna do is we're gonna create since we're writing this is the best so we're gonna put website okay and now we have created the, the link to this website so let's save this Okay, and then let's open it. And this is the best website, and we go back. And just to show you that it is, I'm just not, this is not a, a fluke. Okay, let me, let's create some, another file. Write new. And we're going to copy this one from here. Okay, copy, and we're going to go here, and we're going to paste this, and let's say we're going to create the title that this is 2016, okay, and then, now you see everything is kind of gray, because the, the thing is what we need to do is, we need to save, do the save as thing, okay, so we, we will save this one as, let's say, web, web, site HTML, HTML okay so we save it here and now you see everything appears in, in colors and everything because now it recognizes that this is a website okay but in this case we're gonna, actually going to be linking back uh, no we actually leave this one like it is then we're linking back but on actual index we're going to be linking to the website and you see again it gives you right away the, the the correct spelling and everything so you can just right away right click it and it saves you time so what we'll do is let's open in a preview and it's opening up this is the best website and we're actually going back to the actual website website uh, just to prove that for you to sure let's put it here in our website with a paragraph, this 
is a website page. Okay, so let's save this. And let's refresh this. And now we go website. This is the website page. When we go back to index page, this is a website page. So you get the idea. So I'll show you um, in the next next tutorial. We're gonna have a look how to to link to the blank, but within uh, within your within your folder, this is how you link it. So if you would have something like a um, so if you want links within the page, this is how you this is the syntax for that. So you would write the href and you would write the actual uh, website where you want to go. But uh, let's say this time we want to change it and we want to write here Google. And of course the the syntax would be a little bit different because we're actually going uh, outside. We're not staying in the folder. So what we would write is HTTP semicolon so slash forwards uh, and obviously the HTTP is for the google.com. Okay, so let's save this and go here. And this is the best Google. And now when we click on a Google, we go to the Google. So now we've created the inside and the outside links. So we can either uh, go throughout our folder or we can make actually the outside link to the other website. And the syntax for the link is uh, less than a href and then depending if we're going outside if we're looking for something on a web then we have to uh, make it like this if we're staying actually in the folder and which is another reason why you should if you're creating a website uh, you should uh, save your files in the same folder because it's going to make a lot more easier than for you to, to access them you don't need to do any kind of extra work what you just do is pretty much right and it's uh, and right away tells okay so this is the file that I want to get so I'm going to that file. Uh, thank you very much for watching I'll see you in the next video.